Hi, I'm Philip from Optimize Lab, and in this video, I'm going to be talking about how to set up UTM parameters in your Google Ads account. Now, briefly, I'm just going to touch upon what UTM parameters are. Uh, if you want to set them up, I'm assuming you probably already have a good idea, but just quickly, I'm just going to go into what UT UTM parameters are and what they're used for. Um, so I'll just show an example here on this uh on this next screen and this is a landing page that's using utm parameters um so the big the actual landing page url is the first bit here uh because it is uh, a client's url i'm going to blur out part of it um just to protect um the client but everything after this question mark here, everything after that is a UTM parameter. So this is additional information uh, about where the user has come from and about the user journey that gets pulled into the URL. And then once they land on the page from the URL, it can get pulled into uh, things like hidden fields in the form um, so that that data is being pulled into the CRM. So you can see there are things like device, keyword, uh, campaign ID. So this is all useful information that we might want to be collecting about uh, people who visit the website and carry out certain actions so that we can make better decisions in the future. So that's briefly what UTM parameters are and what they're used for. So how do we set these up? Well, you can select, you can customize which UTM parameters you put into your URL. Your URL. So firstly, we're going to take a look at that. So I've created a sheet here with all of the Google Ads UTM parameters that are available. Uh, and this sheet will be provided uh, within the description of this video. So you'll have access to this. And you can see here that we've got campaign ID, ad group ID, um, you've got the uh, physical location, you've got the match type of the keyword that was used, uh, you've got um, the network, whether it was Google search or search partners, you've got device, so you can be uh, very, very um, comprehensive with the type of information that you're getting about your visitors. Uh, you can also see the ad, uh, which which is the creative or the keyword that was used. Um, so a lot of useful information here. And you put all of the UTM parameters together into a string. So I've got an example here for Google Ads. Uh, and I've also got a Microsoft Ads uh, example just as a sort of bonus. And Microsoft Ads um, has some of the similar types of information, but it's slightly different. Uh, but you create this string here. Uh, so we've got one here, which creates, which contains match type, uh, device, uh, keyword, etc. Um, and so what you want to do is you want to copy this. You want to copy this string here. And then what you're going to do is you're going to place it into your Add your Google Ads campaign. So we're just going to go back over and we're going to take a look at the campaign in question that we want to add these UTM parameters to. We're just going to click on that campaign and then we're going to click on settings and then we're going to go to additional settings and then we are going to click on URL tracking options. And you can see here that's where we pasted that string so that. Um, Every time a user clicks on an ad, these this information will be entered into the URL. And you can also click here to test and it will test all of your different ad URLs. And you can see what it looks like to have the parameters added to your ad URLs. Um, so I hope this video has been informative and useful and will help you to set up UTM parameters within your Google Ads campaigns. If it's been useful, then please feel free to give the video a like. I'd really appreciate it. And feel free to subscribe if you want any additional tips, tricks, and strategies for managing your Google Ads campaigns. And thank you for watching.